Manitoba Public Insurance has released its list of 2009's top frauds. The fraudster who came in at number three was maybe not so injured after being injured in an automobile crash. The woman told her case manager that she was unable to work due to the injuries from the crash. The woman, who was a professional driver, began receiving income replacement payments. After several months, the woman insisted she was too injured and traumatized to drive. This information raised the suspicions of the case manager, who referred the woman's file to the SIU for investigation. It was soon discovered that she had resumed her job and was driving daily. The woman was convicted of fraud over $5,000 and one count of driving disqualified. She received two fines totaling $4,000 in order to pay $17,917 in restitution back to the public auto insurer.